Good evening YouTube family. Patricia here again and welcome back to my channel. Tonight I am going to be making a neck bone stew. Now these are the neck bones that I have soaking in lemon juice. I'm going to wash them off real good. And um, then I'm going to... Uh, season them up and let them marinate for a little while let the uh ingredients that i put on them marinate for a little while and then i am going to be using my pressure cooker tonight my instapot yeah and then i am going to i will be adding these uh some of these red pepper onion blend the three pepper onion blend and then i'm going to put some lime and some baby lima beans in them and i'm going to put all of this okra in them and these are my seasonings that i will be having i will be having uh garlic minced garlic some mrs dash some Maggie pollo. I'm gonna put some put a can of tomatoes in it and onion powder, black pepper, lara seasoning salt, onion powder, uh, garlic salt, and I'll put a little bit of this uh, chicken broth in it, maybe a half a cup. And uh, that's all I'm going to be doing. And I just may cook some cornbread with it. I'm not for sure. It's hard to not eat cornbread with something like this for me. Even if it's just nothing but a, a small piece. Okay? Be right back. Okay, I am back, family. Okay, now that I have uh, marinated the neck bones, I um, put it in the pressure cooker. I'm just trying to cook. Start, it's starting to cook. Okay, I am going to stew this. I'm gonna put it on stew. And I am gonna put all of my little ingredients in here to help it cook I mean, while it cook and I'm just gonna uh, let it all cook together and stew up and uh, it'll just be a nice goulash that's what it's gonna be I think I am going to make me a pot of a pan of uh, a small pan of cornbread to eat with this um, to complement it in here. So, yeah, this is going to be my neck bone stew. And I'm cooking it in the Instapot because I want it to um, hurry up and get done, get done as quick as possible. Because um, I want to spend the rest of my evening enjoying myself. Okay, 
Well, this is um, the beginning, and I will show you the end results of what I am cooking tonight. Okay. Okay, now here we have it. My neck bone stew. Hmm. I haven't tasted it yet, but from the looks of it, it looks like it's going to be good. They're nice and tender. Falling off the bone, actually. These neck bones had a lot of meat on them. I decided not to cook any cornbread. Um, yeah, I'm just going to eat it like this. It's going to be tempting to not cook any cornbread to eat with this. That's a weakness for me. The cornbread. Um, but anyway, oh, and I meant to tell you guys about the acorn squash. I made a new foods video about the acorn squash, right? I didn't like it. What I did was I... I cut it open and I uh, washed it. I washed it real good and I cut it open and I put some oil on it and then some some salt and pepper and I baked it for like 35 minutes and I even put a few bacon bits on them and I tasted them and I didn't like it so maybe it will have to grow on me but i don't know if i will even be eating it again because i don't like it so that that was my yeah that's what i wanted to add and this is what i am cooking tonight and i will be eating for the rest of the week for lunch all right thanks for listening and watching and have a wonderful evening